Hello class, my name is Miss Diamond, and today we're going to be discussing conic circles. Now, first of all, a conic circle is a set of all points that are equidistant from a given point called the center. Now, in this case, we're using a conic circle that is not translated. A non-translated circle will always have a center of 0, 0. If it doesn't, then that makes it non-translated. Easy enough. Now, to find the answer to our problem, we are going to use the distance formula. Now, on a conic circle, it's usually given a point. With an x and y coordinate. Now, our point is right here. So we're going to measure the distance from this point to our center. We're going to use our distance formula, as you can see right up here. And after doing all the math, our answer comes out to be 3. So the distance from this point to here is 3. Now we want to find our radius. Our radius can be found by using x squared plus y squared equals our radius squared. Now, as you can see, our radius will be the number 9. Now, does anybody have any questions? Yeah, how can you circle in the real world? Well, a circle can be used in the real world with things such as wheels on a car. With that shape, it gives the car mobilization. Any other questions? Can you show me another way to use circles? Okay, here's another way to apply circles to real life situations. Yeah. 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 Yeah.